And ranking number one. Brain is winning today. A lot of responsibility. Choose wisely. This is just hiding in the bushes. Did she just rank me last? Damn, this is getting hot. If we can spice things up together, then I'll, I'm down too. You and Eddie. Y'all had that whole secluded moment right there, so. We just wanted to talk. Right, talk about what? Just about stuff. I have a feeling that everybody in the house already knows that me and Eddie have a little thing going on right now. We hadn't really chatted, like got to know each other. Okay, nothing okay. more, nothing less. Honestly, I just kind of hope me and Eddie just, you know, keep vibing out for the rest of the time here. I mean, it's only a short amount of time. We're both single, so I mean, I think he would be like a fun moment. Okay, but if I catch all of the bushes or something, I'm gonna have to say something. Avery, can I just say, like, you are one of the most genuine people in this house, and like, I feel like we haven't even talked that much, so I'm just right. so glad we're sitting down right now. Right. HB King, like, is one of those people that you just know everyone's gonna like them. From the second he walked through the door, I was like, all right, like he's gonna be a fan favorite. How'd you feel about last night? Oh, when we played Never Have I Ever? No, literally, and when you said that you didn't like ever use like a water cup for like even lemonade or just a little bit of Sprite, not even just a little bit of Sprite? I don't know, like I just felt like guilty about doing it. I think one time I actually got a water cup and I accidentally put Sprite in it and I felt so guilty that I literally walked up to the cashier and I was like, I'm so sorry, like, I'll pay for this accidentally like, put Sprite in my water cup. <laughs> please, please. <laughs> no, and this, no, and it was also a shocker to me that you like have never vaped. Like when the vaping question was asked, like you yeah. never vaped. Like, yeah, with all seriousness, I actually have never like even tried Vaping. I feel like a lot of people are surprised like, mm -hmm. when I say that answer. And also I had um, one of my best friends mm -hmm. actually had tried vaping a few times and one night um, he did it and ended up having a really bad seizure and he had to be rushed to the hospital. We were all so freaked out about mm -hmm. him and I guess that was just enough for me to be like, I to just vow to never even try it. It's just so scary. You, you don't know what can happen. You bringing that to my attention like actually makes me afraid to actually continue to vape and yeah. like to continue to waste my money on those products. Then yeah. I can vow to you today that I will not vape ever. And if I need you, you're just a call away. Right? Yeah, just, just a call away. away. <laughs> just a call. Oh my gosh, it's time for rankings. Yeah. Well, I already know I'm 10th, but oh. let's see what you are. Yeah, let's see. I'm gonna get number one today, hopefully, hopefully. <laughs> Well, here we go, babe. So we're all in the living room right now, and I'm kind of nervous. I just feel like everybody hates me. Oh, my house ranks. Yeah, let's go. I still think I can win this game. I was second place on the leaderboard yesterday. I am wondering who I pissed off. I guess I'm too bland for y'all. I'm trying to be out there. I'm trying to meet y'all. I'll do better today, I guess. I okay. Are you kidding me? Eighth place? Michelle. You were my first girl. At least I'm not last, and I still have plenty of time to make my way back up to first. Yeah. All right, I'm not mad about it. This is new for me. This is new for me. Honestly, I'll take it. A tie. Who are you tied Eddie. with? Oh, oh no. What the? I see that I'm number four, tied with Eddie Girl. Thank you, guys. I'm so happy. I love you guys. The prayers worked. Thank you, God. Yeah. I'm pleased with being number two, but I'm a little surprised because it is early in the game. I don't want to put a target on my name. And we got Ray. If they aren't scared of me now, they should be. Yeah. Head to the challenge zone for today's challenge. Let's go. Yeah, Oh God, here we go. Well, it's time for a challenge we're calling Triple Threat. Ooh. I got a feeling we finna be in some type of obstacle type course thing. I see noodles, I see balloons. Girl, what's going on here? Here's how it works. You and a partner are competing in a three-part obstacle course using trends from your favorite social media platforms. First, you will meet me and I will read the first part of an original TikTok audio clip and you have to finish it. I will then give you a viral dance move that you will need to perform. Once you've gotten them correctly, you'll head over to the second station, where you'll attempt to capture the perfect boomerang while popping a water balloon. Once you've captured the perfect boomerang, you'll head over to the last station, 
where you and your partner have to down two bowls of noodles for a good old fashioned mukbang. Okay, let's see. I love me some noodles. Whoever finishes the course with the fastest time wins and gets a special prize. But before we get started, Rave won our last challenge and gets to pick teams today. So Rave, come step next to me. So, of course, I get to pick the teams, you know. I guess just a perk of being that girl, really. For my first team, since they wanted to be all cozied up in the hot tub yesterday, I'm gonna go with Eddie and Eileen. Oh, okay. Eileen and I are gonna f***ing kill this challenge. For my next team, we're gonna give some Caucasian realness. We're gonna do Maddie and Ace. <laughs> okay. Ace and me have this in the bag. And then my babies, I'm gonna do Matt and Ace King. Yeah. Okay. So I'm partners with Ace B King, not Naked Ace, the other one. I'm not mad at it. My lovelies, Jake and Coley. Let's go, oh, yes. Coley, yes. Yes. Last season, we did an optical course with TikTok dances included and water balloons. I think I have this in the bag. Of course, Michelle, we gonna eat it up for real. Mm -hmm. so. Of course, I'm gonna put me and Michelle on the team. She's kind of obsessed, so yeah. She's like a perfect like sidekick. Sounds good. Line up in your teams and let's get started. Eddie, Eileen, time starts now. Okay. Finish the lyric. I ain't never seen two pretty two best, best friends. friends. Correct. Now the dance move is dice roll. Correct. Now move on. Boomerang time. Go, go, go. I'm a TikToker. You know, I already got the dice roll down. Pretty, pretty simple. Wait, it stopped. Open it. Open it. You open the phone, Eddie. Ready, set, go. Okay, Richard, put the phone down, we're going to the next station. Oh no, I am so nervous about eating these noodles right now. Wow, Eddie is shoving that entire spaghetti in his mouth. Yeah, I literally saw the bowl, started using my hands and said F it. How is she beating you, bro? Okay, I'm done, we're done. Mm -hmm. All right, you guys are done, time stops. We did pretty good. How the f can she finish her noodles before me? Ace, Maddie, time starts now. <laughs> finish the lyric. Ladies and gentlemen, the volume inside this bus is... Astronomical. Wait, what? Too astronomical? Uh, 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 okay, no, incorrect. I'm saying astronomical and Owen's not giving it to me. Like, what am I missing? Moving on to the next one. Nobody's gonna know. Nobody's gonna know. Finish the lyric. They'll know. They'll know? That is incorrect, but that is the time what? penalty. That the dance move is the dolphin dance. The correct, move on to the next station. We're already off to a bad start. Ready? Oh. Ready? Ready? Oh. Pull it up. These are Stop pulling them. No, That's she's heavy. pulling it up. All right, ready? <laughs> What is going on with these water balloons? Three, two, one, go. Good. Move on to the next station. I gotta crush this noodle station in order for us to pull off a win. Wait, did he feed it? One go? Damn. I'm just gonna give this boy my noodles. Like, I know he can finish them in like two seconds. Yeah! You didn't it. Come back. It's just like full on. I don't know where it went. Your time starts now. Let's okay, go. the lyric is Hi guys, so da 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 da. Yes, I did that. And you would do a two for a tag. Correct, okay. The dance move is scroll dance. Squirrel? Girl, we're f Can we go to the next? Oh. The next one is the mop dance. <laughs> mop, mop. Mop, mop. Two, one. Did we get it? Was that a yes? Yes, we got it. We okay, got it. period. They really got us doing boomerangs. Love this 2014 energy. Oh! Yay! Yay! Get into it. As soon as we get to the noodle bowl, girl, I grab the whole thing of noodle and just put it in my mouth and start drinking that water down in it like it's soup, girl. Okay. Ding, ding, ding! Wow, that was fast. <laughs> Holy <laughs> moly. I'm here to win. Bring it on, babe. Jake, Coley, time starts now. The lyric is, fun fact, actually really, really... Sad fact! Fact, fact! Correct, and the dance is the woe. Oh, oh, correct, move on. That's so easy! All right, this is easier than I thought. I actually know the dance move. One, two, three. All right, moving on to the next station. Here we go, guys, come on, you got this! I just know I'm not going as fast as the other competitors. This is not going good. <laughs> Cole, you can help with me. Oh. She's gonna pee. I'm over here shoving these noodles down my throat. Jake over here is like taking his time like one by one, like Jake! There's so much on the ground. Can you show me the bowls? All right, your time is up. You guys are done. Wow. I am like gagging on the noodles. And then finally I go like, and I throw it up. Oh, you know gross. what? But that's we gross. had a good time. Ew, that's so disgusting. <laughs> she literally pulled it out of her Should I eat it? No, absolutely not. No! <laughs> I throw up noodles. I'm traumatized. I'm quitting this host job. Are you guys okay in the head for real? You're a freak. You threw that up? Yes. I thought you just put it on the ground. I swallowed it and then it came 
out. No. This whole time, I thought she just threw her noodles on the ground. And I thought I was being the hero by eating them. But I guess I just ate her throw up. Final round. Time starts now. Finish the lyric. Chicken wing, chicken wing. Hot dog and bologna. Correct. Now the dance is the whip. That is correct. Move on to the next station. Michelle is honestly just as competitive as I am, so there's absolutely no chance we're not going to win. Okay, three, two, one, go. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Get to eating. Mama noodles are disgusting, and they have so much sodium, and they're going to make me bloated, and I just can't deal with that today. She's eating it with the fork. Come on. Oh, this isn't dinner. This isn't. Oh, come on. Time, you're good. Oh, my gosh. Time is up. It. Wow. Okay. okay. Great job. Can I just take my win to go, please? The results are in, ladies and gentlemen. And in fifth place, we have Coley and Jake no. with a time of two minutes and 13 seconds. I'm honestly not surprised that me and Coley got last place, but you know what? We had the most fun. So I think we're the real winners. In fourth place, Eddie and Eileen. Ooh. That doesn't make any sense at all. Landing in the number three spot, Maddie and Ace. We saw that coming. Will the two remaining teams please step forward? Oh my God, I'm stressed. And the winner of today's challenge with a time of 39 seconds is Rave and Michelle. So this is my second challenge win, and also I've been ranked first in the rankings now, back to back. Rave and Michelle, unstoppable. Well, since you guys won, do you want to know what your prize is? Of course, yeah. Owen, tell us. Well, since you had to eat those plain noodles, we're going to reward you with a lunch with a very special guest. Okay, who's the special guest? You'll find out, but everyone, head to lunch. Let's go, I'm out. Can we go talk? That's yeah. Up. Of course. So I think I'm gonna pull Ace aside. I think he's really cute and I just wanna feel him out. Like, what's up with you? I'm just chilling. What's You're so you? mysterious. And I will be honest, I was talking about you the first day and I take I it all back. I take it all back. I know, I, and I respect Cause you're that. a really cool person. Thank you, yeah, we've got to know each other a little bit better, especially after that date night. So like, what are you looking for in this house? Like, a relationship, like? Me personally, I'm not because I, I do have a girl back home. <laughs> yeah, he <laughs> hit me with that one. I mean, I'm, I'm just here to try and win the competition. What about you? Yeah, same, you know. I mean, I was looking for a guy here, but yeah. What about Jake? I thought... Jake doesn't... Jake's not about it. I mean, do you have anyone else in mind? Because, like, I, I got you if you... If you... No, I mean, maybe Eddie. Really? Yeah. Him and um, Eileen have been, have been kicking no. it off yeah. lately. I don't know. I just thought you were like really cute, but I appreciate it. Thank I you. don't want to mess anything up. No, yeah, no, 100%. Yeah, I do have a girl back home. It's our first date. It's our first date. Are we good? The team to beat for real. Our guest is going to be probably some overhyped TikToker. Rave and I clearly don't need any pointers on how to win. Owen, what are you doing here? What am I doing here? I'm your special guest for today's lunch. Oh, That's wow. what I'm doing here. Well, of course, it is Owen. He gets to give us insight and tips and strategy, whatever. You are on fire, though. You realize that, right? Like, you are ranked number one back-to-back -back days. You've won two challenges. Like, you definitely have a good chance to win. And Michelle, even though you've been kind of down in the rankings recently, you're still not out of this. Advice I would give to the new contestants would be, Keep your friends close, but your enemies closer. So you need to make sure that you're cool with everyone to the point where you're getting consistently ranked high every single day. Trust me when I say you're gonna wanna win this show. I'm trying to eat this chicken. <laughs> Dude, yeah, I don't like the spaghetti. I just wanna eat the chicken. I've seen too many people grab noodles with their hands today. I gotta go, I gotta go. Why well, do you say I'm gonna eat I wanna throw up now? Ray's been killing it. Like she's number one on everything. Like, yeah, she how do you has. feel about that? I respect that. She's killing it. Everyone's on on Same. her side. Honestly, she could win this. Yeah, no, for real. But I think someone needs to take that spot. Rave's been winning everything, but admittedly, I've been ranking her first as well. She's been crushing it. Respect to her, but we're gonna have to make a change to this. Someone's gotta pull off the number one spot. Don't you wanna see someone else kind of take that number one spot? At least for a little bit. I like, mean, how would respect. We how like, would we do that? We gotta work it out and like try and get some other people on board. I love her. Like, Rave is a queen, but I was like, oh, sh like, she really could win this whole thing. Rave has been number one, right? Yeah, well, she ranked me last, so. She did rank you last, but, I, dude, we both we both agreed you could be that number one spot, easily. I love Rave, and she's super nice, but, I don't know, I guess it just makes it easier for me to, like, rank her low, because she did it for me. We got 
figure out a way to get her lower. Like, what if all of us and Jake ranked her last, and maybe I can even talk to Coley. Should I tell Eileen too? Like, no, I don't know. trust Eileen. Matt is being kind of two-faced right now, and honestly, it's pissing me off. I just heard a master plan between Maddie, Ace, and Eddie, mm -hmm. and they're talking, they want to they want to bring Rafe to the bottom. Oh. They formed a little alliance. Hmm, we're gonna have to address this. Oh, Rafe! She's sitting, yeah, she's sitting trying to make a hardcore alone. She's sitting here like, oh, like, we're sick of seeing Rafe at the top and like Michelle's winning and like Matt's I like I put this. Michelle at the top yesterday. Girl, and you, like, I'm gonna pick who I think I should know. deserve it. I feel like everyone's trying to pull an Owen Holt, like, I don't think there's any alliances, but I know there's something like crazier going on. I feel like everybody's blowing this out of proportion. I'm just trying to watch from a distance and I need them to enunciate. I'm trying to hear what they're talking about. Yesterday, in the hot tub, uh. me and Eddie kind of have a little alliance going on. Until today, I find out he's making up. Eddie's for everybody. Let's Ed, no, I could have told. No, girl, I could have told you that. I don't know why they think that this is gonna work. I hate drama. <laughs> I mean, I wouldn't think this is drama. It's just some people need to let it click. It ain't clicking for everybody. They're not thinking long term because they burn that bridge with us now. Every single time we get, we're going dead straight for their asses. And we got way too long of a game left over for them to be doing that. People have been coming up to me like literally tons being like, okay, you're on last season, like let's make an alliance. You put me on top, I, like put the, put the blah, blah, blah. Yeah, people have been saying that. I swear to God, I will before I be in an alliance because it is not fair. Guys, just so we all know, if you put someone, if you do an alliance, it's just gonna switch up. Literally like, you know what I mean? Because we have two weeks and everyone's gonna do an Owen. Everyone's gonna be like, okay, we have to have an alliance, put this person at top because she was at the bottom, put the person on the bottom on the top. You do understand what I'm saying? It's not gonna work out. It's I was so down to rank Rave last and then she found out about it and I felt so bad about it. It's the person who wins should be the person okay, who deserves it. Okay, so let's it. just forget about everything. You can't, you can't always do that. You can't always like start something and then be like, I'm I sorry, let, me, let me just forget about it. Let me just forget. It was, I'm not gonna say who it was because I don't want to get them in trouble. Why are y'all talking about me and can't talk about it to my face? Let's get that sorted. Can I talk to you? <laughs> they just brought up the fact that like, if you win another competition, two more competitions, you win this whole thing. And that's what got to my head. Because but that's like not even true win. though. Yeah, like I didn't even know you we were, I didn't even know we were ranking you last until they said, I mean, we, we aren't ranking you last, but I didn't even consider that until they said it. So I know why you're mad. Like you're upset because I agree to it. And I'm, I'm sorry. Like, actually, now I'm not gonna rank you last. Like, I promise. I don't know. This girl is delusional. So, I'm not gonna rank. Actually, I'm gonna rank you in my top five because I don't wanna be a part of this anymore. I'm, I'm out of it. No, I'm not mad at you. I love you. I love you too. Hey, Eddie. I'm cold. Can you come out here? Yeah. I just want to ask you something. So I'm just chilling and Maddie calls me, pulls me outside, and she's just saying how she's going to rank the people. You want to win. Do you want to I do want to win, but I just said to her face I would put her in the top five. This puts me in such a sticky situation. Who cares? It, look, at the end of the day, I don't want to be a b so should I put oh, her at the bottom? No, I, look, I don't want to be a b I told her I wasn't. Okay, you know I what? Am. I'm just going to explain my reasoning for putting her at the bottom. Exactly. That's all you got to do. But, like, my thing is, Coley f***ed us over. Dude, Coley no, did. Like, she Coley goes and us tells over. everybody. She's like, oh, we had this whole thing things. going on. And that's why we and still got to keep going And then we asked her, and then she totally said what we were talking about. Yeah. Yeah. If Ray wins one or two more times, she wins the whole thing, and there's literally no point of us trying to play the games. So I should put her at the Me bottom. and Ace are still, like, we came with her. Fine. We're still putting oh her at the I'm bottom. I'm gonna seem like such a oh. bitch. I told this girl to her face, I would put her in my top five. And now, Eddie is making me rethink my decision. Like, how many times do I have to go back and forth about what place I'm putting rape? Maddie's going around trying to get group up people to join this quote unquote new alliance that they're forming. They're outside and they're like, oh, well, Rave is too powerful. She's now gonna win. Um, we have to dethrone her. Michelle has won too many competitions. She's too powerful. We have to put her at the bottom. Why? Eddie takes me to the side and he's like, you know damn well, like I wouldn't ever put you at the bottom. No, but Eddie's a little sketch out. So I'm like, well, now what the f you say? I'm in the room with Michelle. I'm telling her things. And of course, you know, 
we have to fabricate some things. So let's add in a little Michelle baby. They are saying you are too powerful too. And hopefully that gets her a little heated enough to throw them at the bottom as well. Maddie's like, oh no, no alliances. Nah, that's not what I meant. Like, no guys, sorry. Like, you guys know I'm stupid. I didn't think this shit through. Like, oh my God, but, but, but you know how she be acting afterwards. Whine and cry, baby. Damn near at tears. I'm like, girl, get it together. Like, say what you have to say. Like, talk your shit or like, don't say anything yeah, at all. Like, you can't say it to your face. Why say it? What? Exactly. Where is she? <laughs> she said, where is she? Last question. I don't know. See, you can never trust a f that pulls up in a bedazzled bikini. No, I literally have issues with Ivy because I wanted. I was like tight with her on day one, and then every time I feel like every time I say something, she just like turns on me and attacks me. Yeah. Did you hear her earlier? She was like, "Girl, I heard what you were saying." Yeah. Like, was it, Elise, she stop right making here? me look bad. Yeah. What? Weren't she like sitting over here and then she yeah, said, "Yeah, did you hear?" Her? Yeah, I, I heard it. Dude. I just hope they're not talking yeah. about us, cause Why, dude, Eddie, they were what in the, they, do? they were in the room. We were kind of loud. You were kind of loud, know, and she said some drama. Loud. So Eddie thinks that Michelle could hear us, which honestly hasn't even came up into my mind until now. I'm gonna go in Michelle's room and you talk outside and I'm gonna see okay, if I can okay, hear you. Okay. Talk loud too, okay. like really loud. No, you do it. Hey, what are you doing? Wait, we were... Do what? <laughs> oh my god. No comment. I'm just gonna tell her that I told Maddie to go look for my chapstick in their room. Hey y'all, I'm being for real. Where my chapstick at? Michelle had it. What, you want me to post me to a new chapstick? Dude, get over it. Wait, why are you getting mad? No, I'm literally- you're weird. You guys were trying to go in my room. That's weird. To find my chapstick. You saw the chapstick get thrown past I you. know, but I have it in my hand, but I kept going to your room. That's literally it. I have not seen Michelle this mad, and I'm kind of scared of her right now. Oh, it's a reasonable thing to be pissed off. I don't really know. You. I don't know why you're going in my room. I have expensive things in my room. I don't know if you're gonna, you're sus, you're weird. I don't know if you're gonna take my shit. Like, don't go in my room, don't open my shit. You guys know the rules of the house. I don't go into your room and touch your shit. No, so don't go into mine. Like, I'm what? sorry. So, no, like, I'm genuinely No, like, I'm really sorry, Michelle. It. She scares the f out of me. You know what's throwing me off? He's talking to another girl. I don't know, dude. Literally, stop. I don't want What? Kiss who? Fine, I, I mean, I, I will, I will. If you're not trying to make a move on me, f it, I'm gonna go to Maddie. You want me to kiss her, I can kiss her. Look, this is how we should be. Sunny's on for the rest of the trip. I don't know what we're doing, but I like it. Where are we going? We're gonna go mind our business. That's not what it seems like we're doing, but I, I like it. All right, here we go once again, the baddest bitch at the computer. In ninth, we have Michelle, which is kind of funny because she seemed nice. For ninth place, I put Maddie because she's been really shady. I put Michelle, I hate her. I'm gonna have to put Michelle. I put Michelle. It's your ninth, you really tried it. I don't know who you thought you were playing. Maddie, that's not surprising. Um, she definitely did showed her like true colors today, so she deserves to be down at the bottom. I put Matt again. Coley's in fourth. Yes, I'm gonna keep Coley where she is in fourth because she's kind of showing her true colors. She's not no fake bitch. I like that. Fourth is Maddie. I feel bad for her. You can tell she's being a little unincluded. Ace King, he's moving up in the rankings for me. I've gotten a lot closer with him. I put Michelle. I actually put Raves. I put Maddie. Taking first place, I'm gonna put Jake. My boy Ace, I had to put my boy Ace, you know, he, he did, he killed it out there and I had to give him props. In first place, I'm actually gonna put Michelle. I put Ace King as first. Surprisingly, I decided to put Coley. And Jake will flip the script just cause no one is even looking at you right now and uh, you have no way of getting anywhere. I put Eddie first because he's really cool. Like I really got to know him today and I definitely trust him and I'm looking forward to getting to know him better. Michelle, she's been very nice to me and she won the challenge. Challenge, so I guess I should be fair. I'm just gonna step away. I know I made the wrong decisions on that one. Are you guys ready to go? Wait, I, I want this one. Oh, I blacked out. Matt, I get your that. nosy ass out of here. Are you kidding me? Your account got banned on TikTok. Whatever happens in our room stays in our room. I bow, I bow, Ray. That didn't make sense. Oh, it's just like upsetting. Like, I don't know. I don't even care. One thing goes wrong, his life is ruined. <laughs> I'm Owen Holt, and this is Awesomeness TV's Vibe Room.